Hey YouTube, US Mintman here again. Uh, I just want to make a kind of a quick video. I was at work yesterday and uh, I got on the topic of uh, guns with one of my co-workers and uh, he was talking to me and he was saying how he wants to get a gun and he was uh, like, what do you think I should get? You know, and he, you know, he was thinking about a Glock I think is what he was he was saying. And I told him, what's this for? And I think that's the main thing you need to ask yourself. If you're in the market to buy a gun, what's it for? You know, ultimately you're going to make your own decision. It's what you prefer. But certain guns are better at certain things, and that's always going to be it is. You're not going to snipe with a shotgun. You're not going to take a bolt-action rifle and, you know, make that your home defense. Um, at least you shouldn't, in my opinion. Um... So, I asked him what, what it was for, and he said, uh, or I asked him if he was going to carry it or anything. He's like, no, I'm not going to get my concealed or anything. I'm, this is just going to be in the house, in the home. And he'd talk about oh, getting a Glock or something, I, I believe that's what he said. And I told him, look, for home defense, I really recommend a shotgun. They're cheap. As far as guns go, they are for there. They are on the cheaper spectrum of firearms. Um, ammo is abundant. You know, you're not really running out of shotgun shells. They're really easy to get, and they're close quarters. You know, really good, very destructive. So if you're cornered in your house and you want to shoot somebody, if you have to shoot somebody, not if you want to, a shotgun is going to be your best bet. Um, you know, and for home defense, you know, get one of the kind of the shorter ones, you know, not the ones meant for hunting with a really long barrel, but a shotgun's a shotgun, so. So that's what I told him, and he was, I don't know if I convinced him or not, but, and here's something, here's what I want to say. A long gun, shotguns, rifles, they're a lot easier to shoot than a pistol. First time I picked up a pistol, I couldn't hit anything. It's really hard. You have to train with a pistol. Not only that, with um, a shotgun, you know, if you're getting buckshot or, or birdshot, whichever you use, I recommend buckshot. You don't really have to worry about penetration, over penetration, I should say, over penetration. Um, you're gonna hit what you're aiming at, and you're not gonna go through several walls and, you know, hit the next house across like a, a rifle would, could. So, um, yeah, it's definitely dependent on what it is for. Home defense, shotgun's the best thing. Um, any any professional or anybody who's been in the gun uh, industry for a long time um, will tell you that, that the best home defense is a shotgun. Best carry, obviously, it's going to be a pistol. You know, you're not really going to carry a, a rifle or a shotgun around all the time. You can, well, depending on certain states, obviously look up your state laws. Um, in my in my state, you can. But I don't necessarily agree with just strapping a shotgun over my shoulder and walking down the street with it. I just don't think that's a good idea. I think it's more hurtful to uh, our cause than helpful. So, uh, and obviously, you know, if it's... If you kind of want something in between, you know, some sort of, you know, short rifle would be adequate as well. AR-15s are good home defense rifles as well. Um, especially for somebody who's sensitive to recoil, a smaller frame person or a lady perhaps. Um, and even in shotguns, you can go down to 20 gauge, um, which are a little bit more easily uh, felt recoil. Um, uh, so there are options, but uh, yeah. So when you're buying a firearm, just make sure you know what what it's for. Um, ask yourself that, and then ask someone who knows what they're talking about. You know, do your own research um, and uh, find out what it what it is for, um, and train with it no matter what. Um, and you know what, pistols require more training than long guns, and that's just the way it is. Um, so yeah, so ask yourself what, what, what you're getting and uh, why you're getting it. And uh, go from there. I'll see you guys later. U.S. Miniman signing off.